So uh, we wanted to show you userful multi-seat Linux today. So what we've got here is we have a Core i3 desktop box, a single computer here, running what appears to be four wholly separate computers, but actually they're just pluggable DC-125 docking stations. So uh, userful multi-seat Linux is a version of Linux, um, but it's a commercial version uh, where they've uh, added a bunch of great functionality for schools and other types of organizations and they've added the functionality to allow the uh, docking stations like the pluggable DC-125 to just plug in and instantly bring up a new terminal. So I'll actually do it with one here on the end so I can easily unplug this and then just plug it back in. And what's happening is Userful is actually seeing this as a collection of USB devices, a USB graphics device, a USB keyboard, a USB mouse, and then this USB cable goes back to the computer itself and this device get, uh, does all the communication with the main computer and gets all its power through that one USB cable and up pops a login. This VGA cable is actually connected to this monitor. And then when I associate the, uh, the, the proper keyboard and it also figures out which mouse goes with it, I can then just click here and log in. And now I'll shift over one to the left here and we have another DC-125 docking station. Same thing. I'll uh, press the key to associate the keyboard, and now I have another computer. Now keep in mind, there's, there's actually nothing in here but a collection of USB devices. This is a $65 uh, USB docking station that is much less expensive than any whole computer you can buy. Um, these, what appears to be two wholly separate machines, and I'll launch a browser here on each of them, are actually just USB devices that are sharing the computing power of this one main machine here for you know really significant cost savings. Um, and I'm going to just go to userful.com, you know, and so you know, kind of for web browsing and for applications and even for light video, um, it's a great solution. For heavy video, it's not a good solution because uh, ultimately, especially as you get up to you know, five or ten uh, USB stations sharing one computer, um, USB becomes your limitation. Um, but USB is fortunately uh, able to handle quite a lot. So I can drag a window around and you can see that it's really quite responsive. Um, this isn't a big browser window, but I can scroll. It's quite fast. Um, again, you know, going over here, bring up a, a site that, uh, you know, has a lot of text for scrolling. You can see the scrolling is extremely smooth. And there's nothing that I can do here that affects this station over here. To these two students or whoever they are that are sitting at these two stations, it appears to be wholly separate computers. They, and it's because Linux is a true multi-user operating system and user, Userful has built on that. So everybody gets their own files, their own permissions. Um, as far as these users know, they have their own computer, even though in fact they're sharing a common one. So um, it, it's easy to get a, a ton of uh, uh, stations on Userful. On a core uh, i3 like uh, this machine here, we'd probably recommend scaling up to a maximum of about, uh, about five if you're going to go with a, a kind of video heavy where you might want to be doing YouTube vid videos and, and video is a key part of your, um, you know, of your scenario. In fact, let's actually, while we're doing this, uh, pull up two videos here. Um, so I'm going to go in here, um, edit extras, pull up a video on this one, and then I'm going to do the same thing over here, go into extras, pull up a video, and, you know, so you can see for two stations, um, you know, the video quality is, is really good here, where these monitors are 1280 by 1024. Um, we, uh, the DC-125 intentionally uh, limits the uh, the resolution of the monitors to 1440 by 900 or 1280 by 1024 so that it can smoothly scale up to a lot of stations. I can log in over here and start a third video going on this station. And you can see all three videos are going simultaneously. And you might notice just barely a reduction in frame rate right now, but really not that much already with three. So uh, 
So on this kind of core i3, you know, certainly five stations where you're kind of having student quality video is no problem. Um, if you were really uh, just doing programming or just doing word processing or, or text or something, you could uh, easily get up to 10 uh, on this kind of machine. And this is not an expensive desktop machine. This machine itself uh, costs only about uh, $700. And then each of these stations are $65 each. Um, so that's it. So this is Userful Multi-Seat Linux with the DC-125. And now, for those of you who stuck around this long in the video, I want to show you one more surprise. So actually, we have a fifth station that's connected to this computer. So if we head back over here to the back uh, of the computer where everything's plugged in, we have one extra cable. It's maybe hard to see, um, but it's coming out here. It's along the floor. This is an extra long 10-meter uh, USB uh, 2 cable. And it kind of loops around there. We had plenty of extra. It comes up over here to a fifth uh, DC-125 that's actually running off the exact same machine over there. So I'll, I can log in here. And I now have a fifth computer um, that, you know, I could be working here. Um, for all intents and purposes, it looks like I have this computer all to myself. But in fact, I'm sharing uh, the computer there that's in the other room. Um, so there you go, the DC-125 uh, docking station and user for multi-seat Linux running with five stations on a Core i3 Intel processor machine.